Hey guys, MI Treasure Hunter here, and I'm back with another Pokemon Go tips and tricks video. And today we're going to cover hatching eggs in Knox. Um, if you did not know, you can actually create a script, and basically, when your character would be AFK, you can have it doing a motion and thus hatching eggs or accumulating the kilometers to hatch eggs. So first of all we're going to look at I got an egg that is 1. like 6 or okay 1.66 kilometers so it's close so that'll be the one that we're going to run this on so over here on the right hand side fourth icon up script record when you open that up obviously there's going to be nothing there you got to create a script basically what a script is it's like recording your gameplay and then the Knox program will run it for you over and over and over so basically it's like you're doing setting waypoints or um, and then you let it go so all you do is start with settings and uh, it's pretty simple. F1 starts at recording. You're going to do whatever type of course you want with your character. And once you're done, you're going to hit stop, which will stop the recording and save it. Now, don't start recording until you're ready to start moving your character and stop it as soon as you're ready to stop moving your character. Because this will what you're going to do is you're going to make whatever you're recording into a loop so if you have hesitation it's going to hesitate in the running of the script so what I'm going to do I'm going to create a script here where I think I'm going to make them go pretty much in a square so um, I'm going to have them go like 30 steps north so I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the W key like 30 times then I'm going to hit the A key like 30 times, then I'm going to hit the S key 30 times, and then I'm going to hit the D key 30 times. And I'm not going to hit them too fast because I don't really want them to run because you can adjust the speed in the script. So, um, But I want to have it a big enough area uh, because I tried just a back and forth, and it works, just a straight going forward and back and forth, but it didn't seem to be real efficient. So we're going to try 30 steps in each direction. So I'm going to start the recording and uh, make this script. So first thing I'm going to do is because the last thing I did was interacted with this interface is I'm going to touch on the screen over here to make sure that now this window is my active window. Now I'm going to in just a second hit the F1 key and while I'm counting I'm not going to talk so it's just going to go quiet. So okay and I'm hitting the F1 key. And hit the stop key and it doesn't matter that it was saying it was going too fast um, that's just a, a, a warning now that they put in there so I have recorded and what we'll do is we'll just go ahead and play through at normal speed without adjusting it yet and just see how the loop that I just made so we'll go over here and we're gonna hit play and I'll speed actually probably speed this up maybe I'll speed it up maybe I'll let it run normal time so what I did is I went 30 steps one way 30 steps another way kinda got a little bit fast you kinda wanna keep it you know even as far as how quickly you're tapping the keys because when you adjust the speed later you know if you when accelerated if it's going too fast um, to start with then it's going to be even faster you know and could cause issues
So it looks like it's it made this okay because it'll just continue to keep going in this script. Okay, well it ran, yeah, it ran it the one time. All right, so now we go into settings, go to the second one down, repeat till manually paused because you want it to basically you're going to go AFK you want it to go in that loop that you just made and let's try a speed of acceleration of 5 hit save and now press play well first of all let's see where we're at with our egg oh we're at 1.91 miles so it's going to hatch this egg in no time whatsoever so anyways let's hit play so now it's going to do this and that's a little bit fast I'm gonna have to slow him down 1.5 or 0.5 acceleration that's a little bit fast I know it's gonna pop up the warning which isn't a big thing but I don't want it to go too fast because I want it to count and I don't know let me see if this is counting or not. Yeah, I don't think it is. So, what we're going to do, I'm going to go ahead and stop him and slow this down to say, well, let's try three and see. Okay, that's looking pretty good means that you can adjust the speed yourself um, this even might be a little bit too fast I know I want it a little bit faster than the normal walking but not too fast because if you're going too fast then obviously it won't count so let's see if this is And I can see that I didn't get completely a perfect square because I am there we go okay so and what did we get because it was a, a 343 Zubat okay so I'm gonna go ahead and stop the script so anyways that's how you do it um, you can do any type of pattern that you want I would suggest a probably like a, at least a 30 step pattern because um, I tried a 20 I tried a 20 just forward and back and it just didn't seem like it was doing much it was taking forever so and then you want to adjust your speed up and down um, so just check out your eggs and make sure that they're you know actually counting the steps and that you're not going too fast and once you do that you can just set all your eggs up in incubators and when you're ready to go AFK you know you just um, like I said the script will be right there you just hit play and that's all that there's to it and that's how to use Knox when you're AFK to actually go ahead and hatch your eggs please leave a thumbs up and uh, subscribe for more videos Take care.